Hi, I'm Gary Watts, Principal Lecturer in Business Administration at Swinburne University of Technology. I was involved in the APTEA program when it began in 1991. APTEA, Australian Program of Training for Eastern Europe. It all began with the fall of the Berlin Wall and the Australian government wanted to do something to help Central Europe. Swinburne's role was to provide the basis of a formal education the first quarter of an MBA, the very first group when they arrived in Australia. They travelled for nearly over 35 hours to get here. When we got to meet them, they were just such warm, vibrant people that we could see that they were different from us and that they're different dressed and so forth. But we thought it's going to be important to help them settle in as quickly as possible. So we asked staff if they would involved themselves socially with these people, took them to the football, Australian Rules football. One of them took them to the races several times, invited them home for dinner and those sorts of things to get them to know more about the Australian way of life. One of the Aptia fellows was very keen to maintain the what they call the Aptia spirit by running congresses back home in their own countries as they organised the first one in Budapest. A lot of them were there and three or four of the staff from Australia came across because we liked each other so much and we knew this was a way to keep together and not have to lose that bond that we'd made while they were here. Twenty years later we had our last uh, Congress. As we get older and more mature we seem to enjoy ourselves more and more. Aptia has been such an important part of our life. The Aptia Fellows are generally almost unanimously been a wonderful group of people who have been keen to experiment, to look at life and to share their feelings and uh, it's been a great blessing to know them and I've learned a lot from them. No matter how many years pass, the Aptia spirit holds us all together.